now on a fresh set of Continental tyres. It is number 911 Porsche, the big spin at the bus stop. Big spin, Jeremy. Looks like he got the rear wing, got into the tire wall there. He's moving now, but... Yeah, he lost the rear you know, wing as yeah. well, hasn't he? This is... Uh, you might see some guys diving for pit That's road here. Fourth place car. Too, yeah. Fourth place car in GTLN. Then problems for... Uh, was that Patrick P Nick Tandy? Um, oh, Porsche off yeah. on the grass. Uh, Sorry. Bus stop, yeah, yeah. Bus bus stop, yeah we were just talking that. about yeah. yeah, Lost the rear wing and uh, definitely had contact with the tire wall there. I don't know... We, Sorry, were just see, we were just seeing a shot of that. He was running with um, one of the GTLM cars. Number th with the Corvette was right behind him, I think. Number oh. three car for Garcia. Whoa. Ooh, big off. Big off for the 911 car driven by Nick Tandy. And damage on the rear, damage on the front as well. Did it just step away from him? That might be what we've been talking about. Just getting out of the groove there into the bus stop chicane. And there was zero grip, just a little bit wide on the entry. The car switched ends so quickly. Thankfully, Nick caught the tyres rather than the safety, safer barrier, but it's whipped off the rear wing of that Porsche. It's pummeled both sides of the uh, rear bumper, it looks like, and also caught the front as well. So that car immediately going behind the wall to be uh, received by the team, and they can assess quite how much damage has been done to that car. Thank you to Diana Binks as well, who's just taken over from Shea Adam down in the Continental Tire pit lane, who reports uh, that actually the 9-0 car has got a misfire that they are trying to address. Meanwhile, you've managed to find uh, somebody to chat to. I'm with Mike Conway from the numbers F1 running engineering car. Uh, Mike, you were obviously having a nice seat up there on the pit wall, and I've just managed to drag you down. Um, are you sort of relatively happy with how your strategy is playing out so far? Uh, hard to hear you, but... Um... Are you... <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, but Mike can't hear me very well. Are you happy with how the strategy is playing out so far? Yeah, it's been... Um... It's been tricky, obviously, my stint was rain on and off, and then um, I think the car seems okay, seems quick, but I think our sister car seems very quick most of the time, so uh, I think they have the upper hand right now, but we just got to keep hanging in there, keep make, you know, making no mistakes, and just get through the night and um, see where we are in the morning, because um, you know a few people are dropping out here and there, so just got to keep plugging away. What's the biggest thing that you're finding that you're having to address? What's that, sorry? What's the biggest thing you're finding that you have to address as the uh, night goes?